Hello guys, how you doing? Welcome back, SimUK here. Finally, 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 EA, EA Sports is accessible again, so we can actually log in and play the game. Honestly, they're in absolute shambles right now. Um, Corn Ferry Tour, and we're at the Wisconsin Open, and we're playing the Straits at Whistling Straits, and oh my god. Did we get our butts kicked? We are, the projected cut line is three under par, we're currently five over par. So it's going to have to be a miracle round if we want this to work. Good luck me. Be right back. For a heck of a battle these next three days as we show you the current <clears throat> leaderboard here on this Friday. A number of folks in contention, including our leader. Hmm. Okay, so we could go three wood for safety. I kind of feel like the driver through the middle might be the way to go. If we get lucky. That looks pretty good. That's nice. Good start. Well, that breeze is coming pretty hard from the right. Did a great job of controlling the shot against it. Second shot straight ahead, and we go to Iona Steven. Yes, hello, Rich. What a treat we're in for today. The backdrop of Lake Michigan and over a thousand bunkers. Some reports say a thousand and twelve. So finding the fairway essential around this track and we're off to a solid start. Right, I'm hoping the wind doesn't take it too much. Oh, it did take it quite a bit. Oh. Underestimated it. That's got to be disappointing. Good line, the fairway, and the approach winds up in a bunker. Oh, that was online as well, wasn't it? Okay, safely on the putting surface out of the sand. Would have maybe liked to run that up a little further, but that's not the worst shot in the world. Apparently this is that pill, so a little extra touch. Oh, where did that break oh, come from? That's not a harbinger of things to come. Where did that break come from? I couldn't see that the other way around. Okay, good putt there, but it is a bogey here at one. And that's going to drop him back down to six over. Oh, this is a tough old golf course, this one. Yeah, that's in the fairway, so maybe a chance for a bounce back after that opening bogey. I would Second like to ahead, see a bounce back to for sure. Iona Steven. And it's a long and slender hole, very challenging, and being on the right-hand side makes it even more so. We're looking at a blind second shot. With that pop bunker just 35 yards short of the green, making it even more tough. This is a real gamble, this one. Kick over. I could have given it quite a bit more as well. Didn't realise I could have. Well, just a good solid shot right there with that three wood, Frank. That's an aggressive layup, really trying to force that three wood down and get it as close as possible to the green. That's two good shots if you can't reach the par five. We could flop this right by the hole, couldn't we? That would be nice. Two good shots on this par five, leaves that simple little chip, and that was beautifully played. 
Okay, no problems there. Finishing off a of birdie at number two. And he'll get things back to five over. Five over. Don't even know what to say. Right, so the wind is against me. I'm thinking an eight iron. Far over to the right hand side. Nothing too special. Maybe a little bit high. That looks good. How's that going to sit? Wow, the wind. Hmm. Okay. Okay, just left of the hole, and now a putt for Birdie coming up. This would be a big bonus if it went in more than likely just trying to get this one close. Oh dear. Oh dear. Well, I think he was being extra careful with that one, but it, it turns out a little too careful. So we are going uphill. Little bit right to left, I'd say. Nicely done. It is a far here at the third. And Damn, these are hard. At plus five. Good start. Yeah, nothing to fault there. Good balance, good follow through, and a good start to this hole. Second shot straight ahead, and we go to Iona Steven. On the fourth year at Whistling Straits, it's challenging enough. You just have to find the fairway. That's what we've done here. So, still a chance of making a par or better. Will the wind cut the six down enough? It is low, isn't it? I'm going to go seven iron. I don't think it's going to be enough. I'm going to go six with a high loft. Good. Maybe the seven would have been okay. Let's bring in Nota Begay the third for a look at Birdie. Ooh. This doesn't look too complicated at all. I don't think he needs to give away the hole. This is pretty straight on. I'm convinced, but we'll have a go. Oh, oh, not bad. Pace. Absolutely perfect there. Down the slope. It's in for a birdie. There's a chance, isn't there? back to four over par. There's a slim chance, isn't there? I mean, I'm going to have to do miracles or something, but there is a slim chance. Gone very left. <clears throat> Second shot straight ahead, and we go to Iona Ooh. Steven. Mm. And it's a smart play to take it down the left-hand side here at the fifth hole, and most likely we're looking at three shots from here on in. That looks good. I'm happy with that. Oh, the wind. Gave it quite a bit of extra warmth, didn't it? Need not have hit it as hard as I did. Pitched well, but rolled much further than I hoped. Probably should have picked a different shot type there. This will be a 14 foot putt here. Lovely to get a birdie here, wouldn't it? Downhill. Oh, 
Oh, that didn't break anywhere near as much as I expected it to. That is really disappointing. Whoa. Yeah, that's a good putt. It is a par here at the fifth. And he'll remain at plus four. Very lucky there. That's annoying. Could have been a birdie. Good one. It's nice, looks nice. That first cut. Oh, oh that's damn. a great tee shot. I know it doesn't count as a fairway hit, but when you're that far down there, the first cut is absolutely fine. Take five yards off it because it's downhill. Hopefully the wind will just bring it over the extra little bit. Be right on the pin. Backspin. Aye! That'll do. Quite a good uh, shot here. Deft touch there. Very well judged. Let's see if he can knock this in. It's for birdie. Okay, well done there. It's a birdie here at the sixth. And he'll try and fight back as that scores back to three over par. I can't believe how much better I'm playing this time round. Right, so we're definitely dropping a club. I think we're dropping two clubs. We're going to go high. We're going to aim all the way up here. Maybe, maybe on the green. Yeah. Good luck, me. Good luck. Oh, I could have gone a bit lefter. Hmm. That was obviously well struck, but it came in a little too hot, and that one's going to run out and leave him a much longer birdie putt than he would have hoped for. Let's just try and put it next to the hole. Oh! Pretty rubbish in the end. Yeah. Mm, that's going to leak out to the right and trickle away. Not the right reach. <sighs> that one in. It is a bogey here at the seventh. When are they going to give and us that's that camera? Move him back to four over. Should be okay. Well, you can't walk out and drop it any better than that. That is a fine tee shot right there. Definitely windy. So a breeze at his back as he readies his second to the par four. Would you reckon a nine iron with a low draft? Let's try and get it close. Could have done with just a smidge more. Nice shot right on the green and a pretty easy putt on the way. Pretty. Pretty okay, seven feet. Okay, we'll right take that. Line. That's a birdie here at the eighth. And he will definitely not say no to that. Oh, we're so nearly on it, aren't we? Oh, God. It's going very right. Oh, no, lost that one dead right. Crap. Oh, and that one nosedives right into the thick stuff. That could be problematic, to say the least. Ah, uh, we may get out of it. I loft. Take 
be on. Oh, that was the right length as well. Not taking the easy road on this hole, but still a chance to get out of here respectably, Frank. Yeah, if that ball had just missed that bunker, got some decent distance out of that deep rough. Mm, that is a good-looking pass out of the bunker right there. Got that to stop in a good place, leaving just a few feet for par. Okay, good putt there for his par here at the ninth. And he'll go out in 34, two under par for this front side. So we're two under at the moment. If you take out the bo the bogeys, we'd be um, four under, which would put us one over overall. And um would have been spectacular. I forgot about this tree. Oh, what a horrible tree. Put a bit of draw on it. Hit the tree. Big problems. That is really and big that problems. That ball definitely slowed up a bit. It'll wind up coming down in the heavy rough. Gonna take an extra club oh, or two to what? get out of this mess as he sets for his second. All right, this is telling me we're gonna reach <clears throat> with the wind as well. Can't believe it myself, but it says it's gonna reach. <clears throat> and it does. Wow. Didn't check, Frank. Yeah, just not enough spin on that. Um, really, I mean, that almost like took that first bounce and just ricocheted forward. Go for it. What are we looking at here? It's a downhill. And if we hit it there, and hopefully the, the roll will take the rest. Oh, just safely in. It's a par here at the 10th. And he'll hold steady at plus three. Doing my best, guys. I'm trying to keep us in this one. Nice and straight. Just what you want at this point in the round. You're trying to find a rhythm, hit fairways, hit the middle of the club face. That's what they did right there. Now a second from well over 300 yards. This will be about positioning. It is low. I'm a bit worried about it. Okay, it's all right. Well, I'm not sure he got every bit of that three wood trying to get home to this par five and two, but still in the ball game for a birdie. We could go for a long flop. We have pretty much no idea where it's going to land, but it would be close enough. Like that. Two good shots on this par five. Leaves that simple little chip, and that was beautifully played. You bet. A birdie here at the 11. And with that, he's back to two over. Really need an eagle. Right, so a 9-9 nine -nine is going to be too long. Pitching wedge is probably going to be too short, but what are my options? <sighs> Whatever I hit, I fear it's going to get backspin, so I want to go past the flag, really. So 
okay. Backspin. No. Okay. Center of the green. Good shot. This now for birdie at 12. Oh. And this will work right to left, but the slope is going to be the big cause for concern here. Could easily run out 5, 10 feet past the hole. Luck me. Oh, nope. come on. Didn't quite turn as much as he'd hoped. That one safely in. It's a par here at 12. I really and felt like I deserved that. Two over par. Could be okay. Yep, that could be really good. Keep rolling, wow, it keep rolling. So simple when you're going good, doesn't it? And that is yet another solid drive. Put himself in an excellent position. Keyboards, 88 yards. Really good opportunity here. Second shot. This is so risky. Gone really far right and long. Crap. Terrible shot. Uh, that's a bit of a head turner, really. That was a green light situation from that distance and uh, far from the best shot I've seen today. Enough. That's always painful. Just another ah. couple of rolls and it drops. This from about ten feet. It's gonna be a miracle to get this in now. Damn. And there goes our chance, I think. Can't see us pulling enough. Okay, Got back that now. Finished off. It is a bogey here at unlucky number 13. And he'll slide back now to three over par. Oh dear. Get lucky. Oh. Bogey at the last and found the rough here. It's going to be a little bit of a shock on the momentum because it's going in the wrong direction. This will be a good shot if it goes, won't it? Very left. Oh, gosh. Flop to the rescue. One of the hardest things in golf is to turn three shots into two. And with that beautiful use of the flop shot, it's a good chance, really, to get up and down. No issues there. It is a par here at 14. What's the cut off? And he'll stay right where he is. Three. Ah, oh, six under. Just no chance of that happening. Going very left. Oh, dear God. No issues here. That is into the fairway. Wind coming from his right as he gets set for his second.
Yeah, I think we could be okay with this one. Line looks good. Height looks good. Could have been closer. Good clean contact and a nice result. And a chance for birdie coming up. That went so aggressively to the right. Sneak on by. Didn't look like it had that much break, to be honest, but whatever. Okay, a solid par here at the 15th. And he'll remain right where he is. If only I could have done this on the first round, but... You know... First time playing a hole... And of course, even. Oh, that's very straight. And that is dead center right down the middle here to start the hole. So, if we aim all the way over there... Will it stay on? Bit risky. Should run right off the edge. Turning as much as I thought it would, but it's it looks okay. I didn't have as much effect okay, pretty good shot right off the there. wind as I was expecting. Release all the way out after landing in the fairway, but still chance for an up and down birdie at this part five. Oh, I wanted that closer. Eight feet now for birdie. That downhill? It's uphill. Okay. Oh. Mm, well, you miss a hundred percent of the putts that don't get there, right? Lesson learned. Okay, that'll be a par here at 16. And he'll stay right where he is. God, very much. A tricky, tricky hole. Look at this. I'm thinking four iron. Am I thinking four iron? Driver's way too far. The three wood is just going to bounce and go. Maybe it's a three iron. High. Pull back slightly. Looks okay. Again, the wind didn't have as much effect as I thought it would, but rolled quite helpfully for us. That one safely on the putting surface. He has a 12 footer here. That would have been a good birdie, but not to be.
No problems there. That's a par here at 17. And he'll remain right where he is. Oh, look at this. Yeah, a bit of luck here. Yeah, that's a nice swing, and the result is going to be a tee shot that is set up just fine. Was lucky. Gotta think this an extra half club or more as he sets for a second into the wind. How would you think that an extra half club? No way on earth would I think that be an extra half club. What do we think? What do we think is going to affect us more, the wind or the drop? The drop we know is going to affect us. So let's let's be risky. Let's go for it. it looks nice and straight. That could be really good if you get lucky. Ah. Up to the rescue. Good chance to save par after that beautiful flop shot. Looked in trouble there at one stage. Okay, a good putt. Able to save par here at 18. And that will be a second round score of 70. Oh, to God. Under par. The cut so line was six under. Journey. We'll end for our featured golfer. Their two round score falling outside the cut line. And if you focus on anything other than that, then you're doing yourself a disservice. It happens. Believe me. Move on. So that'll do it for my partner here in the tower, Frank Nabilo. For Noda Begay, Iona Steven, and all our crew, Rich Lerner saying, we'll see you next time on EA Sports PGA Tour. That might not seem like a particularly good score, but if you take into consideration that my first round was six over and my second round was two under, that's a difference of eight shots. That's a huge difference. Um... Maybe I just panicked on the course the first time. It's the, It was so narrow and so windy. It was really difficult to, to navigate. But um, I think I had a good crack at it there. We almost pulled ourselves back to even par. But we needed to be six under overall to get through. So even if we'd have gone round in two under on both rounds, we still wouldn't have made it. So... Oh, for our first semi-pro event, I think that's an okay loss. So try and do better in the next one. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you in the next one. Take care. Until then, goodbye for now.